Uh, so Conor McGregor, Mystic Mac is back. He is back I feel in like the Tough House. Sorry. Okay. Now comment below if you are expecting Conor McGregor versus Michael Chandler to be a great fight or not. Are you excited to see Conor back? If you are, comment with Conor. If you are not excited, write anti Conor. Now, Conor McGregor is, has decided to step back into the tough house. Well, there is footage of Conor McGregor walking in back to the UFC like he never left. He's already made cuts. He made cuts? He made cuts already. Wow. There's uh, like five, six guys that may, you know, he cut already off the, off the roster. And uh, yeah, with this tough season, I think this tough season goes down as the best tough season in history. I think the last best season that we had was with Conor McGregor and Uriah Faber. I think that was the most entertaining um, tough season that we've ever had. I think this time around, I think with Michael Chandler, who has a huge personality, who's a showman, I think I think him and Conor McGregor together on in the same screen and you know behind the scenes and you know their one on one trash talking all that stuff is going to go down. I think this will go down as the best tough season in in tough history. Yeah, we do have a great history from Conor McGregor um his previous performances on the Tough House like you said this guy had all-time classic funny moments versus Uri Faber. Um, I don't believe when it comes to speaking that Conor McGregor has lost a step. I'm telling you right now, when it comes to Conor McGregor, this will be the ultimate rebranding moment for a fighter like Conor McGregor when it comes to proper 12, when it comes to his title, when it comes to the, the, the stuff that Conor McGregor promotes, we will see a rapid emergence in his fan base more than before people will re-fall in love with conor mcgregor yeah. after this yeah i completely agree with that the reason i think that though is uh because <clears throat> i mean we've seen a lot of we've seen his dark side we've seen a, a, a nasty side of him but a lot of that was for promotion yeah you know he goes there he he sets the stage you know, he creates this big battle and whatever. But as we saw before in his prior, you know, uh, tough, tough, um, uh, him being a coach and tough, you get to see Conor McGregor as just Conor McGregor, who's a, a simple dude, how he acts, interacts with other people, how he interacts with other fighters, how he's as a coach, how he's as, as a person. And I think that's what people made people fall in love. When I saw Conor McGregor in tough, I'm like, yo, this guy has to be the coolest guy on the planet. Yeah. And I think again, with this season, and thus why I believe it's going to be the best season ever. I think we're going to get to see a different type of Connor because now we're going to see a hundred million dollar net worth Connor. We're going to see the changes that he's made in his life. How has he grown as a person? Is he, is he an evil, nasty person? Is he the guy that was, uh, that he presented himself to be against Khabib against Dustin Poirier? Or is he, you know, is that kind of, you know, showmanship? Is that something that he has to do to um, spark uh, some uh, this competitive energy within him to fight these guys? Are we going to see what are what are we going to see? There's going to be so much to like. Um, so there's so much unknown. But I really do believe Connor is one of those fun, loving, you know, dudes that, you know, hangs out with the boys, makes a lot of jokes, shit talks, uh, does this and that. And I think we're going to get to see that side of Connor McGregor come out. Uh, but we're going to see a little emphasis on it because he's worth a hundred million dollars now. Conor McGregor is back in the UFC. We see him entering the ape, um, the apex building. This is a moment in Conor McGregor's career where people are seeing that he can be re-motivated, refocused and ready to take over the 155 pound division. And I think this is exactly what we will see. Yeah, I do. I do think uh, I think it's gonna be a great fight. Again, anytime Michael Chandler gets into the ring, you're gonna have an epic showdown. You're gonna have an epic battle. It's gonna be a war. Too much power. Da 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 da. It's the motherfucking D O Double G. It's the Petty Boys versus the Pretty Boys. <laughs>